Father, we are thanking you this morning. We worship you, our merciful God, our good God, our glorious God. Be thou exalted, O Lord, in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have given thanks. You will say, Father, by your mercy, answer all my prayers to this morning. By your mercy, answer all my prayer this morning. By your mercy, remove every form of reproach in my life. By your mercy, terminate barrenness in my life. Let's begin to pray. Almighty God, we pray that by your mercy this morning, terminate every form of reproach. Remove shame in my life. In the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Almighty God, we thank you this morning. Lord, we worship you. We thank you because we are serving a God that answers prayer. Accept our thanks in the name of Jesus. Our mommy that we are going to use this morning, Father, bless her. Anoint her in the name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. His mercy is never come to God, we worship you. We bless your holy name because you are the only living God and there is none like you. We worship you because you are the most gracious, you are the most merciful, and you are full of compassion. Accept our worship in Jesus' name. We thank you for this day of mercy. We thank you for making us a candidate for your mercy because the Bible tells us that your mercy, they are new every morning. Accept our thanks in Jesus' name. Thank you for all the past edition of this program. Almighty God, we pray that even in this special edition, Father, we pray that you will make yourself manifest. And everybody watching us all over the world, they will be blessed. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. I welcome you all to this special program, the Moment of Mercy program. The Moments of Mercy program is a prayer program of the Good Women Arm of the Redeemed Christian Church of God, Oshun Province 6. It usually comes up every third Saturday of the month by the hour of 7 a.m. By the grace of God, God has been showing us mercy, has been answering our prayers, testimonies are banned, and we pray that as you join us this morning, the Lord will bless you and show you mercy in Jesus name. This morning by the grace of God I'll be sharing briefly with us on moments of discovery. Moments of discovery. I want to let us know that even during this lockdown God can still discover you and show you mercy. By the grace of God even during this lockdown the almighty God will look for you. He will fish you out. He will bless you and it will do something new in your life. In the name of Jesus. In the book of Luke chapter 5 verse 1 to 9. There is a beautiful story there of Peter. Of Peter. Peter was at the verge of discouragement. He was already packing when the Lord discovered him. Jesus discovered him and showed him mercy. Jesus discovered him and helped him. When all human efforts failed, God will show. Anytime you are passing through a period of failure, 
a period of discouragement, a period of giving up, and God showed up. That can be regarded as a period of moments of mess. In the book of Romans chapter 9 verse 16, the Bible says it is not of him that will it, nor of him that run it, but of the Lord that showeth mercy. God showed Peter mercy by fishing out his boat, and you all know the rest of the story. At the end of the story, he had more than enough. I don't know what is going on in your life this morning. I don't know the period of failure, the period of the discouragement that you are passing through. Maybe you had already washed your net. You have given up on yourself. But I pray that the God of mercy will show up on your behalf and you will obtain mercy in Jesus' name. Another wonderful story is in the book of John chapter 5 verse 2. The story of the man by the pool of Bethsaida. The Bible says this man has been there for a good 38 years. He had given up. Nobody to help him. Nobody to discover him. But Jesus Christ, out of all the folk that, folks that were there that day, discovered this man. He went to him, not minding that whether he was even ready for a miracle. This man was not even ready for a miracle. He had given him up. Even when Jesus Christ commanded him to pick up his bed, he said, ah, nobody to help me. I had given up on myself. But when the moment of mercy will discover you, even when you don't have anybody to help you, the Almighty God will help you in the name of Jesus. The Almighty God will discover you and help you in the name of Jesus. You will discover that these two men that have discussed this morning, they have been passing through a period of lockdown. This man has been locked down for the past 38 years in one place. But even during this period, the Lord located him and had mercy on him. Another brother is in the book of Mark chapter 10 verse 46. Mark chapter 10 verse 46 to 52, the story of Bartimaeus, the blind Bartimaeus. The Bible says when Jesus Christ was passing by, he didn't even see him, but he cried out for mercy. He said, Lord Jesus, thou son of David, have mercy upon me. And the Lord had mercy upon Bartimaeus. Even in his period of lockdown, the Almighty God showed him mercy. I know there is somebody here this morning. Maybe you are in a period of lockdown for so many years. I, that I may not know, 38 years. 12 years, even since you were born. But when mercy will decide to locate you, God himself will show you mercy and he will help you. I want you to pray right away and say, Father, in this period of lockdown, please let your mercy discover me and help me. Let every problem that is associated with lockdown be destroyed in my life in the name of the Lord Jesus. Let us open our mouths and pray and say, Father, in this period of lockdown, no matter what I'm passing through, every form of failure, every form of sicknesses and diseases that have made me to be locked down in a place, Father, send your mercy to me. Let your mercy discover me. Let your mercy find me. Let your mercy help me. And so shall it be in Jesus' name. Number two, even in the period of lockdown, we can even say that the moment of mercy can make you to be noticed. The period of moment of mercy is the moment of notice me. Ruth was passing through the period of widowhood when nobody can be noticed. But because it was a moment of mercy, in the book of Ruth chapter 2 verse 10, the Bible says, Then she fell on her face and bowed herself to the ground and said, Why have I find grace in thy eyes? that thou should take knowledge of me, seeing I'm a stranger. You all know the story of Ruth. She was walking on the field of Boaz. There were so many people there. This was a young widow that just came back, depressed, desperate to survive in a period of lockdown. But even in a period of widowhood, Boaz took notice of her. Boaz can see her. And he said, anything that this woman needs during this period, let her be provided. I don't know what you are passing through. Maybe you are passing through a period of, of sorrow, a period of rep repression. You have lost uh, loved ones. But I want to announce to you that when mercy will discover you, 
you will be noticed. The helpers of destiny will notice you. They will take knowledge of you and they will help you. The same thing happened to Hannah in the book of First Samuel chapter 12. The Bible says, and it came to pass as she continued to pray before the Lord that Eli marked her mouth. The Lord noticed her mouth. Ah, I prophesy into your life today. Every of the prayers you have been praying, the Lord will take notice of you. The ones you are praying silently, the ones you are praying loudly, the ones you are praying in the corners of your rooms, the Almighty God will notice you. He will mark you and He will mark you for mercy in the name of the Lord Jesus. In verse 18 of that chapter, the Bible says, She concluded, Let thy hand made find grace in thy sight. As you are listening to us this morning, as you are praying, even I can see you praying. As you are praying, the Lord will take notice of your mouth. He will hear your prayers and he will show you mercy. You will discover that at the end of the day, the prayer of Hannah was answered. God gave her a heart desire because she, she was noticed and she found grace in the sight of the Lord. Even as you are seated in your homes, as you are watching us online, I want you to open your mouth and begin to pray and say, Father, let your mercy locate me. Let your mercy notice me. Notice my actions. Notice my reactions. Notice my mouth. Notice my legs. Notice everything I do so that it, I can obtain your mercy. Anonimo bere baba o anonimo bere. Anonimo bere baba o anonimo bere. Awa we can come see o anonimo bere. Open your mouth and begin to pray and say, Father, let your mercy notice me. Let your mercy find me. Let your mercy locate me and grant me my heart's desires in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. And number three, in this moment of mercy came, the king could not sleep. And he said, let the book of remembrance be brought unto me. And they brought the book of remembrance and all the blessings of Mordecai that has been locked down for so many years was released unto me. You are going to call unto him. You are going to call upon the Lord and say, Father, let the door of your mercy be opened unto me. Let every lockdown around my blessings be opened in the name of Jesus. Let the book of remembrance be opened and let my moment of mercy bring remembrance and reward to all my neighbors. Send a pass of destiny to me. Let them look for me. Don't allow them to sleep until they have located me. Open to my page of remembrance. So shall it be in Jesus' name. In conclusion, I want you to believe God that even in this period of lockdown, moments of mercy will discover you. You shall be discovered. You shall be helped. You will be noticed. You will be remembered. You will be compensated. A pass of destiny will locate you. And, your, and the name of our God shall be glorified. Shall we pray? Father, in the name of Jesus, I pray for all your children that have heard your word this morning. I pray, O oh Lord, that you will remember them. I pray that you will show them mercy. I pray that you will notice them. Notice all their actions. Let a pass of destiny locate them. In the name of Jesus. Let this moment of mercy be their moment of discovery and let your name be glorified. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' name, we have prayed. We bless the name of the Lord for wonderful message heard from our mommy and I pray that God Almighty will continually grant her the utterance of his word in Jesus' name. It is time to give our offering unto the Lord. Let us pay it into the account showing on the screen. As you do so, God bless you.
shall we pray. Father, in Jesus' name, we thank you for the gift of life and opportunity grant unto us to give unto you during this period of lockdown. Father, may your name be exalted in the mighty name of Jesus. As we are giving this offering unto you, Father, please let it open the door of mercy unto us throughout the day of our life in the mighty name of Jesus. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Praise the Lord. Our next edition of Moment of Mercy comes up on the 18th of July. 2020. See you dear. Be blessed and stay safe in Jesus' name. Great God you are. Mm. Some God, forever you will be the anchor of my life. Forever you will reign. Oh, 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 how great you are! How great you are, my God. Yeah.